a setup. Uh, it's a new setup. So I guess it's kind of a setup, you guys can. It's one of the slides. Come on. So this is a setup that uh, I was telling you guys that uh, Travell, one of my coaches, and Kyle has helped me with a lot. Um, it's called an overtie snap. You guys ever heard of that? No. So this time, partner's going to call a tie um, with his left hand. So it's going to be his, not his lead leg hand, so it's going to be his back leg hand. So all I'm going to do is, I'm not going to be in this position for a long time because my front leg is kind of vulnerable right now. So I'm going to put myself in this position to clear this tie. So when I clear this tie, I'm going over top. The partner collar ties his left hand, he's head to head. My right hand is going to go over top of his head. I'm going to pull his ear to his head. I mean, pull his ear to his bicep. And pull my elbow in and clear that hand off my head. You guys see that? So we're in a good position here. I go over top of his his collar tie. Pull his uh, pull his head, his ear to his bicep. And when I clear this, I'm going to go chin to chest. You guys do this. Chin to chest. So that's what I want to do. So when I do this, that I drop my head and I get that hand off the top of my head. So I'm here, I go over tie, pull his head, his bicep, take off the top of my head, and I'm a bubble. And the shot I'm gonna do is called a low level. You guys like those? Mm -hmm. I mean, yeah. You know what they are? I'll show you. You'll see one. So I'm here, collar tie. Coach has a really good collar tie. He's pulling me in. It's real tight. A lot, this this happens too a lot of times when guys. Uh, I like to be from the outside just because I like I'm a little fast, so guys like try to slow me down. And when they call a tie, they like want to pull me in and slow me down. So here, this is a good way to kind of clear this tie without putting a lot of stress on your back, without like fighting in, doing all this other stuff. It's real easy to just come here, take it off the top of your head. I use barely any energy. I didn't, huh? And I can, and he's lower. True. So when I'm in here, I'm not gonna try to fight in here. Try to like make this a grind, get this hand off my head, and just kind of get caught up in the hand fight. I want to continue moving. I want to continue being on the outside. So this helps me minimize that grind, uh, the hand fighting inside, and I get back to moving, being, doing what I want to do. So partner collar ties, he tries to keep me in here. I go over tie, pull his head to his bicep, chin to chest, take it off the top. And once I get in this position, I want a low level to his lead leg. So after, after he's down, he starts to come up, I let go of my hand, I lower my level, and I shoot to that foot. So a lot of times he's gonna be a right leg, a right leg lead when he's collar tying left hand. So I just wanna lower my level and shoot to his right foot. So he collar ties me again, I'm head to head. Right hand is gonna go over top, pull to his bicep, take it off my head, I'm here, I'm above him. I use this because he's going to react. If I push you down, he's going to want to do. Pop right back up. So I push his head down here. He pops up. I lower my level. And I go in. Right here. Look at his position. Elbow on the mat. Hand behind the heel. Head in the knee. I'm real athletic here. It can move. I never want it. A lot of times, especially in college, at least in our practice room, when I shoot this shot, my head gets caught right here. And then guys sit. So it's real important to do, I'm still working on it as well. It's real important to shoot this shot and head right in the knee. Sometimes it might slip where a guy's sitting over top. That way you can readjust, heels back, and put your knee back, put your head back in his knee. But it's a lot easier to do it right the first time than the second time. All right, so if you guys can, um, put your head in the sweet spot. I call that the sweet spot right here, right in his knee. So, over tie snap, partner collar tie, his left hand. I go over top, pull his head to his bicep here, chin to chest, take it off my head. I'm above him, I see his feet, that one's too far back, this one's right here. I'm going to this lead one. I release his head, I lower my level, right here. Both knees are on the mat, you can have one knee up if you want. I like to go both knees on the mat. And once I'm here, all I'm doing is my head, this is why the sweet spot's important. Can you guys see this? My head's right here. I'm putting pressure over his foot. As you can see, he's kind of falling. This right hand is collapsing that side. You guys, have you guys seen that before? I'm sure you have. So, I'll do it one more time. This is why the sweet spot is important, is important because if you don't get there and you're stuck, 
Here, it's going to be hard to do the finish. And you're in a little scramble. Got some crest lock, you can roll you through, chest lock and freestyle. Um, so if you can, or you need to, get these things off. So I'll do it one more time. Partner collar ties. I go over tie, I try to stay head to head, I don't want to be ear to ear. Over tie, pull his head to his bicep. Take it off the top of your head. He pops up, I lower my level. Right here, head in the sweet spot. Once I get here, put pressure over his knee. Circle my feet, get my two. And if you guys do freestyle, this is a leg lace. This is a really tight one. Start rolling, you just get it. One more time, one more time. So this is important guys, over tie snap. I'm going over tie his collar, I'm going over his collar tie. He collar ties, I'm head to head. I go over top, I pull his head to his bicep. I'm here, I snap, I take it off the top of my head. My chin goes to my chest, I slip it off. I'm here, I'm above him. My hand's on the back of his head, I extend, he's gonna pop up. Right here, he pops up. I lower my level and then I shoot in. I don't wanna, I don't wanna bring him down, pop up, and then shoot straight in. Because this is when your head misses the sweet spot. So I wanna go lower my level and shoot in. Here, lower my level, shoot in. Once I get here, a little pressure over his knee, on my feet, collapse that leg, get my two. You guys got it? Want to try it? Mm -hmm. All right, let's try it. One, two, three.